Candida auris is a new fungi or new fungus that have been identified and it is called emerging fungal infection. It causes emerging fungal infection. Why we are concerned about it? Because it is multi-drug resistant. In other words, this organism could not be treated. Some, some of the strains in this organism could not be treated by the antifungal drugs we have currently. When patients are in hospitals, what they do, they put catheters in them, and because of this, these bugs or these germs stick to the catheter, they make biofilm, which is like sticky material, where it protects the germs, and this way, you cannot get rid of them. What's so exciting about it is, we are now starting to look at the role of microbes, both bacteria and fungi. My research was the one that brought the fungi, or the fungus, as you say, into the forefront. But other people looked at bacteria as well. So when you put them together, you know, this is where we start to understand these could be a good guys, they help us, or they could be bad if they are those that cause disease. And now, if we can develop this area, good news we are starting we may change the way medicine is done we can prevent a number of diseases okay through taking care of our gut it's like as they say everything starts in the gut so that's what's the exciting thing I think in the coming five to ten years we are gonna change the way we take care of ourselves based on this research to me as long as we follow the normal, reasonable way to keep germs at the way, we should be okay. We should not go hysteric about it. Okay. And I think the CDC is really now focusing on this area and they are encouraging people to, the scientists I mean, to look into ways how we can find the new disinfectants, how we can decolonize the skin with how we can treat systemic infections. And also, the National Institute of Health also now starting to pour money into this. This is what makes America great, by the way. When there is an issue, we are able to go after it and we find solutions. Not all candida auras are multi-drug resistant. There are some of them which we can kill using the currently used antifungals. But what we want to do is develop new ways so that if there is a strain or isolate from a patient that is resistant to all the drugs available, we have new ways to do it. And I assure you, we are finding ways that we can control it. And that's why I am optimistic about this, because I know we are going to find a way.